Hello, I'm Lauren James and today I'm going to talk to you a bit about my new book, The Starlight Watchmaker, which is coming out in July with Barrington Stoke. This book is a bit of a departure for me. I usually write very straightforward science fiction that follows real fact and can be justified, but this time I decided to let loose a bit and I wrote a uh, completely magical fantasy sci-fi world set on a planet which is occupied by a very rich academy run for aliens who come from all over the galaxy to learn about diplomacy and intergalactic politics. And it's told from the point of view of an android called Hugo, who lives on the outskirts of the academy, working in a tiny attic as a watchmaker, fixing time travel devices used by the students. One day, a very rich duke, one of the students called Dorian, storms into his attic and accuses him of selling him a broken watch. Uh, he takes a look at the device and finds out that there's the wing of a clockwork beetle stuck in the mechanism and that someone has stolen the quantum energy. They set off on a romp across the campus to try and find out who has been stealing the energy, along with a friend of Dorian's, a giant volcano-sized piece of rock called Ada, who is one of the students and will one day grow in a couple of millennia to be a planet of her own, but for now she is uh, able to move around and she's just a walking mountain. So the three of them explore the campus and try to track down the, who has taken this energy. Along the way they get to know each other a bit better and Dorian and Ada get to learn more about Hugo and the, the androids and why he has been sent to the outskirts of the academy. It was such fun to write, especially because Dorian is a completely pompous, confident sort of rich aristocrat and his, he was just the most fun as a character. His interactions with Hugo make me laugh so much. I hope you enjoy reading it as much as I enjoyed writing it. Uh, and enough, hopefully, that one day I will be able to write sequels.